In today's video, we have Chad here. We're going to go through a vertical jump training workout for guards because he is my starting point guard for the junior team this coming year. Yeah. And he's going to be a beast. You're going to drop like 30 points a game, so we're going to get you dunking. Okay. <laughs> and what you'll start with is you'll have it like this. Yeah. You'll go into a lunge, and then when you come out of the lunge, you lift it up. Okay. It's eight pounds. Yeah. Okay. So we'll do 12 with each leg. So, lunge. Yep, that's one. That's two. Three. Four. That's five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten, you got two more. You uh. can do it. That's eleven. One more. There you go. How was that? Guess what? Like at the when it got to nine, it started burning, but yeah. not a lot. That's good. So now the other end. Yep. That's one. That's two. Three. Four, five, you can do it. Six, almost. You that got was it. weird. Seven, you got it. Eight, nine, ten, two more. Eleven, twelve, there you go. How was that? It's good. Right, we'll give it a few seconds of a break. We're going to go. Actually, inside handles. We're gonna go like this, right. okay? We're gonna go down into a squat, and then we're gonna push this up. Okay. We're gonna try and stay level, down, and then up, okay? How many times? 12? We're gonna try and do 12 times. Okay. Can you lift that up? Okay, perfect. Yep. That's one, try to get your feet a little bit more wider and uh, for uh, more straight, yeah, there you go. That's one, all the way up. You got it. That's two, we'll go for 10. That's three. It's hard as hell. That's four, you got it, you got it, you got it. That's five, you got it. That's six, three more, seven, Eight, you got it, you got it. Two more, you got this. Nine, one more. There you go, that's 10. That was struggle. You good? Yeah. I would've caught you there. Wait, how does that help you uh, do it though? Like for jumping? Yeah. So a lot of your momentum comes from your, like kind of like your lower back and your shoulders. So when you go up, kind of Oh like yeah, cause I up. guess I'm going. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Plus, it also helps where, let's say you're coming in for a layup, so come in for a layup, and I hack your arms off, right? And then, then your exactly. Arms, yeah. Your arms are built enough to take the contact. That's right. When you're attacking the basket, right? Yeah. You go up for a layup or a dunk, and you bring this knee up, that's some of your momentum, right? Yeah. So you can actually build that by using something like this, and we'll do the exact same thing. Lift it up, hold it for a second, and then back down. So what I wanna see is hold it up, balance for three seconds, two, one, back down, back up, one, but it never two, touched, three. But it never touches the ground, really. Yeah, try not to touch the ground. Okay. Like that. We'll start with your left leg. Try to get, get it all the way up to there. There you go, hold it for three, two, one, back down, back up, three, two, one, back down, back up, three, two, one, you got it, back down, try to get a little bit higher. I just need to, I fit in there. Three, two, one, back down, three, two, one, back down, switch feet. Do you feel it like in your like Yeah, right waist? here. Yeah. It's like, it's like the one that like, 
thigh in the waist meat. Yeah. Now we're gonna go five with this foot. One, two, three, back down. 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 One more. One, two, three, back down. There you go. Give it a couple second rest. How's that feel? Uh, so now what we're gonna do, we're gonna get super wide. Okay. Yeah. You're gonna go down on this side. You're gonna lift this up over to this side and back down. Up like that. And you're gonna try to pass to either side. Okay. We're gonna go 10 times back to the right. So that's one. Try to get a little bit lower. Uh, uh, so you're uh, good. Okay. So just a little bit lower. Okay. So we'll call that two. That's three. That's four. That's five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. One more. Ten. How was that? It's weird. It feels like I was doing it wrong. <laughs> going along with the theme of momentum muscles, right? When you go up for a dunk or a layup, you're using your shoulders, right? Yeah. What we're gonna do now is you're gonna try to keep this so that the handle's on the opposite side of your hand. You don't wanna see it drop like this. Okay. So now you're gonna be working on your wrist muscles, but also when you lift it up, you're also gonna be working on your shoulders as well. Okay. We're gonna try and go for, I wanna see you do 10, but if you only do eight, that's okay, but I wanna see you do 10. That's one. Try to go a little bit slower. That's two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Here, go, go only eight because we should have started with your left arm. Okay. Just in case your left arm only does eight. Always want to start with your weak hand first. So that's one. Two. Try to go a little bit slower. That's three. You got it. Four. Five. You got it. Six. Try to get a little bit higher. Seven, one more, eight, there you go. You can put it back down for a second. How's that? How's your shoulders? This shoulder is bad because that's what I was doing. When you do it slow, it burns a lot more. Yeah. You know what fast is? It's just like, it still burns, but it takes a little bit longer. Yeah. So you're gonna get your feet shoulder width apart. You're gonna basically have this ride along the uh, your legs like this. Oh, you're gonna, sl you're gonna slightly bend your knees, but not much. You're gonna try and only bend at your back, keep your shoulders back, and you're gonna be looking forward like this. Okay, no, I haven't you, done this. You don't want to be lifting totally with your back like this. You want to be slightly bending your your knees, keeping your your head looking forward, and just letting it like that. Okay. So you're basically working your hips and your lower back. Okay. So go a little bit wider with your feet. There you go, keep your shoulders back, look forward, and try to bend your knees a little bit less. So you wanna still hinge at your back. So go down, now unbend your knees a little bit. There you go. There you go. Try to keep the shoulders back. So don't bend, don't, yeah, there you go. You got it right like that. Try to go a little bit lower with the back now. There you go. That's one, two, bend the knees a little bit though. There you go, three, four, try to keep the shoulders back. Six, seven, eight, try to keep the shoulders back. 
What's that, nine? Yeah. We'll go one more. There you go. Give it a rest. Yeah. Try to get it over your head and just try to walk along this line. Like that. Okay. I make it look really easy, but it's it's not. Why is that so hard? <laughs> well, if you ever get caught in the drunk test, if you can master this, you'll be fine. <laughs> I'm not going to drink on a mold there, so. That's good. This water bag's my enemy. <laughs> Isn't it a frenemy? Kind of. You got it. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. There you go. Backwards back. You're good. I got you. If you fall, I'll catch you, okay? So, Mr. Chad, yeah. how was today? Tiring. Yeah? Probably going to go home and take a nap. And probably a freezing cold shower? Yeah. How are your shoulders? Burning. How They're is your, numb. How's your back? My back's burning too. How's your legs? Numb. Numb? You're going to be jumping so high. We do this more, and we'll be, uh, he'll be the all-star of Hamilton. Good job today. Anything Thanks. you want to say to the camera? Like and subscribe the video, to the video. Yeah. Chad, you're the man.